Yo, what's good with y'all, man? Welcome back to another video. It's your boy, Toad. Man, listen, as we're diving into 2022, it's just right around the corner. <clears throat> Can you imagine that? 2022, bro. That sounds so much like in the future. It's insane. I never thought that I'd be saying that right now. But check it out. Since we're diving into 2022, every single day, like every day, it is getting harder to be yourself like your actual true authentic self and i'm saying this because you know with social media and, and how many distractions we got going on in today's world it's so easy to constantly compare ourselves to the next person like we look at a motherfucker online we look at their stories their stories be showing like a few seconds of the highlights of their day and we compare like oh man they're doing this and i'm not you know like oh they be on this and i'm not <clears throat> bro you got to be careful who you're jealous of because sometimes you don't even know what you're exactly jealous of man you you don't know their actual these people's actual lives like beyond social media and this is all how it's all constructed bro like they know this shit you know, this is, this is how things are made for us to be depressed and fucking have anxiety and feel all these kinds of ways. <clears throat> like, back then, early 2000s, like, less, less people had anxiety and mental illness and all this stuff. Because social media has, I mean, it's good, but, uh, like, it's good in some ways. But, man, it, I, in my humble opinion, this shit does more damage than it does good in this world. Back then, when it was used just as a tool, that was probably when we should have stopped. You know, we should have put a cap on this shit. Because now it's, like, just so submerged. It's just so involved in our lives. We, we've, <clears throat> in a way, we are merging with technology. I just feel like some people don't believe that. But when you think about it, like, dog, when I was growing up, I used to have to, like, go to my fucking house computer, like a shitty-ass house computer with a... It ran on, like, this big box type shit, bro. And then now you got kids who grow up with, like, an iPad in their hand. Yeah, we're only, talk we're only talking about, like, a 20-year difference. It's really not that long when you think about it. It's scary how fast this life is moving i can't do shit about that that's a helicopter right there <clears throat> excuse me about the noise but yeah man you know like i it's just insane it's insane where things are heading in life bro i just want us to stay woke because man this shit is not real like this shit is not real i speak about this with a passion because like this is our like yeah your internet is useful I met some great people through the, through the internet, but this shit is not real, guys. This shit is not real. We, we need to learn how to have genuine connections again with people. We need to learn how to fucking stay faithful to one another, man. We need to fucking understand that whatever you got going on at home right now, <clears throat> it's probably better than what's out here in these streets. Well, sometimes the grass is not greener on the other side. So I be thinking about it all the time. Like, let's say on Instagram, let's just give this as one example. And I'm not trying to say this about everybody, dude. I'm not trying to <clears throat> classify everybody because, yeah, everyone's different. But let's say, like, yeah, you're looking at this person and they do make good money. They do drive a good car. They do have this and that. But, and like I said, man, they might have a good life. But, but... For all you know, what if they didn't, bro? What what if they worked 60 fucking 70 hour weeks and barely had time to sleep or see their kids or see their uh, their girlfriend or their wife or whatever? But on the outside, it looks like, man, I got this great paint. Like, on the outside, it looks great. Like, on paper, it looks great. Great job, you know, fucking benefits, all that kind of shit. But you're not... You, you see what I'm saying? <clears throat> but you're not living his life like you're not living their life you don't know that's why we really gotta stop caring too much about what motherfuckers gonna say and, and, and we gotta stop 
comparing ourselves with one another because man the only times when i felt not only happier but just a lot more uh successful is really when i've just paid attention to myself and, and what the fuck i got going on like whatever somebody else is doing like who gives a fuck like who gives a fuck how that this is not revolve around me the more I've been doing that this past year or two, like, bro, the more it's been. I, I've been feeling so much better. And I'm only human. Like, I <clears throat> I fell into those traps of, you know, like, not caring and then caring and then not caring. But I, I'm really at this stage right now with, I mean, you see this world. Shit. Fucking, we better just enjoy it when we can. So why not go after the things you want to go after in life? This right, this and this time, like this is a this is the time to do it. There ain't no other fucking time. There might not be another fucking 40, 50 years. You know what I'm saying? Whatever it is you want to do, we gotta do that shit now. Anyways, man. So another note, I fucking kind of hurt my back uh, the past few days, unfortunately. So I've been just laying down, like not doing shit. Like, just been lightly walking and stuff. But I know things are going to get better. Things are definitely going to get better. Just, yeah, it sucks. It sucks I can't do shit right now. Anyways. I'm going to head out of here. See you in the next video.